Alrighty, welcome on over here. If you're very, very well branded offline, you've been around for a long time, people know who you are, or you do a lot of offline marketing, direct mails, billboards, newspaper, or just in general, people refer you a lot. Most of your business came from referral. You gotta make sure that you Google yourself because consumers Google you, right? Because <laughs> uh, that's a, uh, it's a referral. Or you're very well branded offline people, you're always on top of their mind, top of mind awareness. So first thing they will do is they'll Google you, simply try, trying to find out what is your phone number, simply just trying to find out what is your website so they can go on there, right, or to find your address. Rarely do we memorize uh, businesses' phone number anymore, but you gotta Google yourself. Because whenever people Google you, right, this is an extreme example here, if you're doing a lot of offline marketing, people know you, they type in, they go on Google, they type in Desert Memorial Funeral Home. Simply just want to go on your website, go on directions, or call you. Very often it's from mobile devices. But would you do business with Desert Memorial? Maybe, but now you might have second guess because they don't have 3.3 stars on Google. And as families start to doubt, they scroll down a little bit, it's like, oh, wow, on Yelp, your <laughs> two-star rating. Yeah, maybe not bad on Facebook. But now, right, they're second-guessing. Versus, right, let's say your crap salesman, funeral home in... Las Vegas, right? Both are here in Las Vegas. If somebody Googles Craft Salesman, they're very well branded offline, for example, they just wanna find out what their phone number is. Now, look at this, that many reviews, right? Automatically, you might be like, oh wow, right? Everybody trusts Craft Salesman. Look at the reviews on Yelp, right? Facebook. So these days, you got to Google yourself, right? Really, literally Google yourself from desktop and from mobile, even though you've been very, very well branded. In the last 50 years, consumer Googles you these days. They Google you, right? And uh, if they go on Google, they don't see a lot of positive reviews that, or quite a bit of negative reviews, then they might turn away. So these days, Make sure Google yourself and see what shows up on the first few pages of Google. Typically first page, right? But also scroll down and then go on the second page and see what shows up. And also do it on the same thing on your major competitors. Write on a piece of paper who are your five competitors and do the same exercise, right? And benchmark against yourself. Whenever consumers Google them, Right, so they're doing a lot of offline marketing. Whenever consumers Google them, do they have positive reviews or negative reviews? What shows us on first page of Google for them? Maybe they're written up on some major news outlet where it's a lot of positive stories. Then you might want to reach out to those news outlet and see whether they can cover a story on you as well. Versus if you have a lot of negative reviews, negative press, then good for you. So really, you got to do some competitive analysis. Google yourself, Google your competitors, and see what shows on the first page of Google. If you need help doing competitive analysis, reach out to me. Just leave a message. <laughs> Happy to do a, a full-blown marketing analysis, competitive marketing analysis for you.